Beggars can't be choosers, but beggars never quit. Height here, and you already know what this is. It's time for choosing beggars. Let's do it. Our first one is from Rotary Dreams. Can you do $70, please? I can pick up right now. I'm a student and I really need it, please. Yeah, if you can pick up, that's fine. Please don't get me wrong, but would you be willing to do lower? Sorry, but financially I'm struggling for now. If you do 50, it will really help me. No, thank you. 60? $80. Ones like this baffle me. They ask for a price, they get the price they ask for, then they proceed to ask for it lower. My guess is if they got it lower, they would ask for it even lower. This next one is by Bro Laka. Free advertisement. My bike needs painting and your business needs exposure. If there's a small or big business that wants to wrap or paint this machine, feel free to contact me. It can be any color and scheme in reason. I do track days and race events as far as California and New Mexico. No financial obligations outside of you providing paint, labor, and creativity. Thanks. Just because your bike needs painting doesn't mean businesses need exposure. What you need to do is pay for the service that you're requesting. This next one is from Neutron64. God, I can't do all this anymore. I'm so fed up with this. I never get more followers on this account. I need accounts to grow. I never grow naturally. I'm so frustrated and upset about all this. No one just ever follows me. I don't know anymore what to upload. I don't know what to do. My posts no longer have support. I no longer know what to upload. All my effort in making an edit is never reflected in the likes or the followers. Rather, it is the least important thing to me. I thank those who support me still, but I can't take it anymore. I'm so sick of all this garbage and pretending that everything is fine. I can't take it anymore. You literally have 25,000. What are you on about? Well, ask my 25,000 followers because my posts have 200 likes, having that amount of followers. You could try maybe something new that catches people's attention. I don't know. No hate for me. I'm not necessarily siding with the beggar, but I understand 100% where they're coming from. It's very demotivating. However, maybe what they are doing is something that people just aren't into anymore and they gotta work on changing it up. I know if my channel growth doesn't pick up, I'm gonna be looking to try new things. This next one is by The Bald Bearded Man. We are a family of three, no pets, and we own a very simple home in Eagle. There are two bedrooms, one bath, and two offices. One office has a pull-out bed and would accommodate nicely a single person who lives simply, like we do. We've been thinking about posting this for a while and it seems that there's a lot of nice humans looking for a place to crash right now, so here it is. We're looking for someone that would live with us for a minimum rent amount, who could help keep the house clean. Both of us work full time. This means cleaning the bathroom, kitchen, I cook a lot, and vacuum and dust when needed. Garden work also needed. This person must be trustworthy, who also has a day job. No drugs of any kind. Lots of parking available. It doesn't seem like they're looking for someone to live with them. It seems like they're looking for a maid or butler who also has a day job, can clean for them, and pay. I'm not sure they're going to find too many takers. This next one is from Goon1919. Do you still have theme? Message sent. Yes, it's available. Can you deliver it? My son's birthday is tomorrow and I do not drive and I'm looking for this for him. What will I be getting in return? Nothing. I don't have no money. Why? What is your name? Just forget it then. Wait, so you're asking for something and you're asking for it to be delivered, but you're not giving them anything in return. You're asking for a service but not willing to pay. Definite choosing beggar. This next one is by A Real Fake Door. Alright, I'll try to have this back to you by tonight or tomorrow at the latest. Very excited for this opportunity. I was wondering what the pay is per concert though. We do not have a budget for these shows, so there would be no pay. However, you would get credit on the gallery and tagged in all social media posts. The Begging Network has over 100,000 followers, so the reach is significant. We've received a lot of inquiries for photographing events in Beggarsville. 
Our goal is to let folks shoot on a show-by-show -show basis as we work down the list and ultimately work towards locking in a house photographer, so to speak. Alright, I see. Well, I appreciate the offer, but I think I'll have to pass if it is unpaid. Best of, and I'm sure it says lock our wishes. If their network has over 100,000 followers and the reach is significant, then the least they could do is pay people they're trying to get to do things for them. Oh wait, that's right, they're a choosing beggar company. This next one is from Charm City Knoll. Alan Hostetter asks Judge Lambert to appoint him a legal advisor, but asks that they have no association with Skull and Bones, Freemasonry, or any other organizations that require oaths or vows of secrecy. I mean, if you're asking a judge to appoint you a legal advisor, you're most likely going to get the legal advisor that they have available. You don't get to just pick and choose. If you wanted to pick and choose, you can go and hire one. This next one is by Apisabeth. Would anyone out of the kindness of their heart want to be my helper with Blank's party tomorrow? His dad isn't coming and it's been hard to accept. Not her boyfriend either. I need someone to help me keep things in order 12 to 4 p.m. I have very little experience with birthday parties, food, so I can enjoy my son and make sure I get at least one photo with him. Let me know. If I wasn't working, I would. I got you until 2. <laughs> I need until 4. <laughs> well, considering you said it's from 12 to 2 and you want to get at least one photo with your son, if you can't manage to do that within 2 hours, it sounds like a personal problem. This next one is from Wiz in the Bin. I'd like compensation for this. I have recently found a bug in my game. Whenever I try to play a story mode, my characters disappear and go invisible. I'd like 3,000 gems for this. Tardiglia's lovebird. One could ask, have you installed any mods? Uh, is there a patch coming? I don't think they're just going to give you 3,000 gems for an issue that might be well known, but good try. This next one is by Mega Bullock Chops. Hey Jamie, I've seen you write personal songs for couples who are getting married, but I have a bit of a different request. I run a company called This, and we offer horse riding lessons and holidays from beginners right up to experts who want more challenging expeditions. I was seeing if you'd be up for writing us a song about what we do as I think you have such a way with words and it could be a great way of getting more exposure for both of us. I haven't really got a budget at the moment, but if you post it to your page, we'd happily share the song all over ours. Let me know your thoughts. Isla. Hey Isla, I'd be naked if I had any more exposure. Your timing is impeccable. I've seen you offer horse riding lessons, but I have a bit of a different request. I would love to own a horse, and I was seeing if you'd be up for giving me one of your horses, as I think you have such a way of caring for them. I don't have any kind of budget, but maybe if you post a picture of me riding at home, you'd have to give me some free lessons first as I've never ridden one. I could share that on my page and it'd be really great exposure for us both. Let me know your thoughts, Jamie. I love the way this went, it threw me off and I didn't even utilize the beggar's voice because they didn't even come across like hardcore choosing beggar, but they're still a choosing beggar nonetheless. Beautiful comeback. This next one is from 2D Derangy. Hello, anyone here want to do free deep clean house clean on my house? Three bedroom townhouse. Welcome to go live on social media. P.S. Not too much work to be done. It's just I'm waiting patiently for a housework routine from my father in heaven. Please pray for me. I'm in Mount Druid. So you want someone to clean your house for free? No, a deep clean. Please no offers of a regular clean. Okay, you clarified the cleaning bit, but you didn't clarify the other bit. You want it for free? And our final one is by Not Baked RN. Sealed new 2020 Mac something, $1,300. Would you take $200? Please, my son has cancer and his dying wish is to play cyberpunk. This laptop would work perfect for it. Do I look like the Make-A-Wish Foundation? I hope your mom dies of cancer, bitch! Look, little kitty, we all know that it's you messaging, pretending to act like you have a son, you're the choosing beggar, that's how it goes. You know what the giveaway was? Your insult at the end. Alright, that's enough beggars for the day. 
Well, that wraps up this episode of Choosing Beggars. If you liked the video, please drop a like, share my content on all of your social media, subscribe if you haven't already, and make sure to hit that bell so you're notified every time I upload. And make sure to drop a comment down below. It really helps with the algorithm and helps new people find my channel. Thanks for watching. Thanks to my patrons. Have a great day and stay safe out there.